stars got a 12-minute standing ovation from a show where there has not been an empty seat in the whole run. He's taken it to Broadway. He was, for many years, the most impersonated star in this country. It's a pleasure to welcome one of our greats, Michael Crawford. <laughs> nice show. Thank you. Well, I was one of the lucky ones who did get in to see the show. Everyone tell you, you were magnificent, didn't you? You've, you've, I mean, your voice was unbelievably different, sir. Well, yes, I worked, I worked a few months and bought some larger trousers. and <laughs> <laughs> I worked quite hard but on But you're not going to go straight to America, are you, Michael? You're going to have a little holiday, surely. Yes, I've had, I've had the whole day off. And, uh, <laughs> and tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock, I start. I'm going to make my first album with the London Symphony Orchestra. So that's, uh, I mean, it's a thrill beyond belief. For me, not for them. <laughs> but uh, I, I hope we'll, it'll work out. We do it, um, it'll be out within a month. It'll be magnificent. And when do you open on Broadway? Uh, on, in January, the beginning of January. Well, you know, we'll all be rooting for you here. Someone has given us... I mean, I don't know how you feel about the Frank Spencer thing, but you are magnificent in that. One of the best comedy shows I've ever seen. I know you don't do him anymore. They are. <laughs> all our love on Broadway. Good luck. You'll kill him over there. One of our finest exports. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr Michael Crawford. Good luck, mate. Award and hit winning show out to California. While he was in New York, he won the Tony Award. He really is one of the world's great superstars of international show business. I'm thrilled he's with us tonight. Michael Crawford, ladies and gentlemen. Whoa! Thanks for coming on again. I think they know you. <laughs> Congratulations on that. That's magnificent. Oh. I'd like to think we gave you a bit of luck sending you off a year ago to that. You certainly did, yes. I mean, I went... It was just before I'd, I, I, I'd been in to make my first album. And uh, I was really nervous about that. And it sold platinum. I mean, it was wonderful. But, and then to go to America and for that to work. But... Uh, and it seemed really such a short time because they were so really very very nice to us out there and very welcoming but to come home yesterday <laughs> and come and home and uh, came on the palladium to see us yeah. isn't that nice of him hey and let me tell you he won't tell you this he's having a break from show business only for a short period because he's working for a wonderful save the children fund you're going to africa to work with the kids there aren't you yeah I go in two weeks' time. I go to Africa for a, 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 for two weeks and to show really to go to the camps with the children and to show the good work that all your efforts uh, and everyone at home has, has done towards the effort that saved the children and, and hopefully to show some happier sides. So I look forward to that. And there's a telly, there's a Christmas telly with it's you on, on isn't it? Christmas Day on, uh, on, um, uh, yes, on ITV. Or, ITV. Well over, done. The, <laughs> and we're going to see you there. Well, good luck. It's California you're going to with Phantom, isn't it? I go to Los Angeles next, yes. But not for too long. I'll be back. Well, don't work too hard, will you? No. Because we think you're Bye -bye. great deal of you. <laughs> it's nice to see you without your mask on. Thank Ladies you. and gentlemen, Michael Crawford. <laughs> 